Next on This Week in Agribusiness, it's Max's Tractor Shed, where we spotlight another great American farm tractor. Well, Father's Day weekend was celebrated in many farm families with the help of an old tractor. I'll give you an example from Texas. Max's Tractor Shed is brought to you by Mystic Lubricants. Mystic Lubricants are made to make it last. Well, before I get to this week's tractor, I want to follow up on something from last week about that old toolbox that was on the back of my Super H. I finally, Father's Day afternoon, took a look at what had been in that old toolbox for the past 30 years or more, and it was just what you would expect. There were the tools, there were the nuts, bolts, and washers, a well-worn hitch pin, sprayer screens and tips, nothing of value to anybody except maybe Max. But you know what? I may fix up, may restore that old toolbox. Let's take you to Texas, where Father's Day was special because of a John Deere 3010. Sure enough, at Sweetwater, Texas, Mr. Alton Pyburn turned 92 on Father's Day. These days, he's getting to see his old John Deere 3010 used out of the field. He bought that tractor back in the 90s. It just sat in a state of disrepair for about 10 years, and finally, last summer, Alton's grandson, Ashel Pyburn, decided to get it running again so he could use it some as he raises cattle there in central Texas. It was a lot of work, but I'm certain Ashel Pyburn was glad he brought back to life Grandpa Alton's John Deere 3010 in time for his granddad's 92nd birthday. Paging Mark Stock. Mark Stock. Is Mark Stock in the house? Sure he is. With his weekly report from Big Iron. 